Okay, you guys, so it's VidCon day one for me. I didn't come to the very first day and look how many people are registering with me. <laughs> that just shows how late I am right now. I've been rushing for everything. Even yesterday when I was supposed to come, I could not come because I was up like more than 24 hours. Oh my gosh, I'm like rushing all over the place right now. I'm legit like the only one who's about to register right now for creators. That just shows my life right now. I'm like freaking out. After when I parked, I left my phone, then afterwards, then I left my vlogging camera, then afterwards, I left my ticket. This is day one for me, so like I said, I know I was supposed to come yesterday, but I was up for more than 24 hours. I was trying to get all my stuff done, make sure my videos are done and everything like that so I can enjoy this weekend. I'm out of breath because I've been running all over the place, and I'm meeting up with my girlfriend, Ashley. So, yeah, here we go. I'm so lonely. Oh, wait, where are you going? Wait, come back, I need to register. I, was like, oh. I made it! Look over! Hi. Your channel! Makeup by Amory. Woo! Woo! <laughs> so I'm not by myself, you guys. I'm with her. Yeah. No, I'm not alone either. She, she wanted saved she me. Found me. She wanted she found me. I was like putting my badge on. She's like, hey, hurry up! I'm like, oh, someone's calling for me. Yes. <laughs> yes. So we're inside, we're on the second level, and there's air. I'm so glad because my pits are like sweating right now. I just met your name? Marie. Marie. Hi. And your channel, let's show your badge. Um, it's M Rosie, also a beauty lifestyle channel, also me being a fool of myself. So, you know, <laughs> holla at your girl. It's okay, we like to make fools out of ourselves, huh? Yeah. Fools out of ourselves. Fools out of ourselves. Fools out of ourselves. Well, nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too. And it's so nice meeting you too. We're on our first panel and we're hosting it. Hi, welcome to Beauty Absolutely Land. Not. No, we're here. We're in a panel that says what not to get like how to stand out in a sea of saturation. Stand out in a sea of saturation. We need this advice. We need this. We want to be creative. Yes. We're already getting creative together. We're gonna collab on something fun. Get excited. Yeah. I have 10 subscribers. <laughs> um, I twerk on my channel. That's pretty much how I stand out. Um, right now? Yeah. Here's some beautiful unicorns. These are the ones that talk. <laughs> and we're here outside to go grab a bite to eat. As my hair is so gracefully yeah. in my face. I just I met. Up, it's too hot. <laughs> Your name? Frances. Uh, she was sitting down right now. She. What are you eating? Ooh, some, some fries, fries with buffalo sauce and blue cheese. I'm just eating some hair. <laughs> so she was sitting down eating. All of a sudden, I hear whoop whoop. I'm like yes. <laughs> 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 she went with the nude. I was like, what happened to your red? It looks so good. <laughs> so we're still here. We're at our second panel. So I hope we learned something. I went to the first one. It was not as informative as I thought it was going to be just because all the channels that were out there, well, they were predominantly male. So like, I didn't even, like when they were trying to relate to their channel, I didn't even know what videos they were talking about. So we're here for an actual beauty panel. And yeah, so we're going to do this. Afterwards, she's going to Disneyland, which I'm jealous of. Brat. And then I'm going to check into my hotel so I can relax and <laughs> do nothing. <laughs> Order a drink. And the award winning fitness instructor and online personality. She is the creator of Blog Bodies. Fans of Blog Bodies, yes. <laughs> the number one female fitness channel on YouTube with over 250 million video views and 2.5 million subscribers. And I left VidCon. I'm in my hotel room. Uh, my network is really awesome and they got me a hotel room for two nights so I can be close to the event, which is really awesome. And let me open up this window. We need some air up in here. So I have my bed. Oh, that just really happened. <laughs> 
<laughs> Let's replay that right now. So here we are, here's my view. VidCon is actually like right behind the Hilton, like right there. It's like literally right there. And here's my view of the pool and all of Anaheim. Take off my shoes, relax, enjoy this room. I brought my, this is good lighting for selfie. <laughs> I brought my laptop, I can edit and yeah, Glenn's gonna meet me later on so we can go to dinner and Yep, I'm just here relaxing in my hotel room. Okay, overall experience for VidCon day one. Hmm, very interesting. Definitely different than a beauty convention for sure. Like this is the complete opposite. This convention, I think, I think it's good for beauty vloggers to come, but to really learn something, I don't know, because I felt like the panels that I went to were not that informative, and I felt like it was just more personal story on how people got started, and how people balance their lives with everything, but it didn't really answer too many questions. Even the questions that were asked, I was just like, I don't even know what to say. But it was fun though, it was fun to experience this, and because this is my first year, so I'm taking it in. So maybe the panels tomorrow will be a little bit better, but oh, I'm kind of oily. The ones today, I haven't blotted or anything all day. Uh, the ones today were not the best for me, especially like the first panel. It was kind of, it was called how to be, you know, separated in the sea of saturations, which is really important because now that I'm going to be going full force and I want to get creative, uh, I need to figure out how I'm going to make myself different. You know what I mean? more creative, not change my personality, obviously. I'm not gonna be a different person, but just get more creative in my videos and stuff like that. But the first panel, it didn't really answer any questions. It was basically like them referencing, referencing like videos, and I didn't know who any of those vloggers were, to tell you the truth. Uh, the only name I remember was Swoozy, Swoozy? Yeah, that's all I remember. And I was excited to see Andrea's choice because I've never seen her speak on a panel. And then there was Aspen, so I knew her too. And also the other girl, Catherine Ho, or Catherine, yeah. She's the one who did the really good video on body image and I loved that video. It went like viral and she was, I think they said it's already at 67 million, something like that, that's a lot. So yeah, so we kind of learned a little, but not too much. It was more just like biography. So we'll see how day two goes tomorrow for me. Yeah, yesterday I didn't go, I was so busy. I was up more than 24 hours and then I just was so tired and I had so much things I wanted to get done so that I can enjoy this weekend and really not have to worry about too much going on. So with that, with my decision doing that, then I kind of ruined it for myself because then I couldn't come yesterday, but I'm not too sad that I didn't come yesterday for some reason. Just seeing how today went, it wasn't like, I missed out on a ton of information, so yeah. So I'm just gonna unpack my stuff for tomorrow, and yeah, it's crazy how much I packed, because if you think about it, I'm like pretty local here. I'm like 45 minutes away from Anaheim, and it's like, even though you only go on a short trip, you still have to bring so much stuff. I was like, oh my God, deodorant. Oh my gosh, I need toothpaste. I need my face wash. I need my face lotion. I need my under eye cream. Now I need, I'm just like, good Lord, I didn't bring shaver. Ooh, I might tell Glenn to bring, I'm gonna tell Glenn to bring my shaver. Um, let me do that right now before I forget. <sighs> okay, I just texted Glenn to bring my shaver. <sighs> oh, my face is oily. Now I'm just hanging out. I put on my robe so I can relax. I'm gonna take a little bit of a nap because my sleeping's been like shit. Hi, honey. Hi, baby. I'm in the room. I'm relaxing. Are you? Yeah. Can you do me a favor? Oh. Huh. When you come, can you bring my shaver? My armpits, my hair is going to grow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, I'm here on the balcony. I just got ready. I just put on a white tank top and some jeans. Nothing fancy. Me and Glenn are going to go out to dinner, so... I'm just here chilling, just looking at the view and looking at the half moon. Like, look at, I don't know, it looks pretty cool. A little half moon. Oh, well there it looks there. Looks like someone just sliced a pizza. So I'm here, just chilling on my balcony. Pink toes. 
<laughs> tomorrow I go back to VidCon and then tomorrow I have my VidCon party to go to. I'm really sad because I'm gonna see if Glenn's gonna come with me because tomorrow it was supposed to be Sunday his day off from his new job but now he has Saturday off so that's tomorrow but I'm gonna be at VidCon so I don't know maybe we can have dinner and he can come to the party part of for part of the night it starts at 10 o'clock so I don't know hopefully hopefully he can come I'll be sad if he doesn't come with me for a little at least and then I can sleep early I think I could see Glenn I think he's right there we made it we're here at clam jumper tonight Glenn picked me up from my hotel. He's gonna spend the night. He's gonna come to the party tomorrow with me. I'm so happy. I'm lost, you guys, if he doesn't come with me. I don't like to go to the party. Not without Glenn, he's my security blanket. No, I'm literally a security guard. I don't know if you guys know, but there's like been a lot of stories of other YouTubers, like male YouTubers at VidCon, and they pull all these kinds of things because they have all these girls that like basically toss themselves. And for me being my first VidCon and attending this, I totally see it. Like these girls are running. Even Glenn parked, and all of a sudden he he came upstairs in my room and he goes on the balcony and looks. He's like, "Is there like a celebrity?" And it's all these little girls running after like a van or uh, right a car, like the full blown running. And I saw that today and I was just like, oh my gosh, but I'm talking about now, I, I mean, it just sucks because the YouTubers take advantage of their viewers because I've heard so many stories and it just happens, you know what I mean? But it's just crazy though. So we kind of got away from like the convention center area just so we wouldn't have all the crowds, huh? And we're at Clam Jumper and, and Glenn's been dying to eat here because this is one of his favorite restaurants, but we don't have one near us. We used to have one in Torrance, but now they closed it, so yeah. Because it probably wasn't that good, huh? So why are we here? I'm kidding. No, it was good. Really <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Used to go there. But I wonder why. Why they close it? The rent. The rent. Uh, now it's um, we call call it Gen, but now it's Jen. But we don't go to that anymore. That Korean barbecue place anymore. We only go to Star and Gardena now, because Jen gave me the, the gurgles like time after time after time. Time after time. Another thing I was telling Glenn is also at VidCon. I mean, I wasn't. I would, I would, it actually made me excited, but I was just like, whoa, like, everybody was vlogging, and especially, like, if you're a creator like me, I have a creator pass, so I go on the second floor, and everybody is vlogging, and for me, I'm not used to that, because even when I go to the beauty events, a lot of girls don't really vlog too much, or there's not a lot of vloggers, like, period, I don't know, there's this cute little girl sitting right in front of us at the little table, <laughs> she keeps looking at us, <laughs> but, can we say hi? <laughs> but um, what was I saying? So yeah, so everybody was vlogging today. I'm talking about like selfie sticks coming from every angle, babe. So I'm talking about selfie sticks everywhere. Like everybody was vlogging. It was pretty intense, and there's a lot of people there. And I and I don't know. It's pretty cool though. It it made it seem like. I don't know, I almost felt dumb not vlogging, you know what I mean? Like, it was intense with the personalities. Like, I saw so many personalities that were extra loud, extra out there, and I was like, wow, okay. I don't know, I appreciate it, though. It was cool to see other people do what I do, you know? It was intense, though. But the one thing that got me was me and Ashley almost got freaking trampled because people were running after like these boys, I guess they like sing or whatever. It was just crazy. I've never seen so many people run down a hallway, like legit, like a hundred. Like it was the end of the world. So I ended up picking a honey pineapple margarita and then Glenn got, what do you get? Uh, grapefruit honey mule. A mule. You tried a mule the first time when we went to... What's the restaurant in Long Beach? Um, Yard, House. Yard House. Yeah, he had a Hawaiian. It was really good. So I got clam chowder soup and he got potato. Oh, guys, look at this little look car. His, look at his phone. It's right there. This thing is, his car's so loud though. It's like so tiny. Glenn's truck can seriously run this thing over. It's like so tiny. I could put it in the back of my truck. <laughs> you could. <laughs> so I got dry shampoo at CVS. We're walking from outside the hotel. And it's so funny just seeing other people vlog outside. I'm like getting tripped out on it. I'm seeing like really young kids vlog and I'm just thinking, do their parents even know that they're vlogging? It's just crazy to me. Oh, but there's an ambulance though. But right now we're gonna go to 7-Eleven because you guys already know I'm so picky with my water. We have to go across the street so I can have Fiji. 
<laughs> Clem was like 7-Eleven across the street, huh, honey? Yep. I know what's up. <laughs> we made it. We got our Washington. Fiji. Some monster for tomorrow morning. I, Illinois. I know yeah, everybody's so it's crazy so me and Glenn were really close to Disneyland and it's just crazy how many people come from all over hey that Sorry. word <laughs> come from all over for Disneyland it's amazing take it for granted but I keep seeing a bunch of people from VidCon and so there's a name for people that are coming from VidCon VidConians that's what I'm naming them. Bitcoinians. They're all over the place, you guys. Everywhere. We're in the elevator. I don't like elevators. I do. I do. Why so serious? We're going up. On Tuesday. No, it's Friday. You're wrong. Killed it. <laughs> <laughs>